What is up, everybody? Welcome to our next Let's Play on the channel. This is going to be ukulele. This is going to be a, a really good palate cleanser for the channel. You know, it's not a first-person shooter or a horror game or uh, anything like that. We will be getting back to those, obviously, but this is going to be a nice little, like, you know, break in between all that. If you don't know about this game, I don't know how you don't, but uh, basically it's it's like a throwback to Banjo-Kazooie, Donkey Kong, 64, collect-a-thon kind of games, so. But I played a little bit of this, I think. How long did I play? I got, I got a practice file on here, I'll show you. Hour and a half, I played an hour and a half of it, and that's just the first world, so. But it's insanely fun. I think I'm gonna keep that practice file. I'm gonna move over to this file. And we'll go ahead and jump in. This game is so, so fun. I love this game. I only played an hour and a half and I already like am in love with it. It's it's absolutely amazing. It's right up my alley. It has that retro feel to it, which that's what I'm into is more of retro games. And it's collect a thought. I love collect a thought games. I totally skipped the uh, the cutscenes for this when I'm on my practice file too. I was just kind of like running through it just to kind of get a feel for it and see how it played out before I did a let's play. I've never beaten this game either. That, I, that practice file that you saw is the most I've ever played this game is an hour and a half, so it's all new to me. Oh, we gotta hit X to... Oh, wait, no, we don't. Is it automatic? I guess it's automatic. I'm not sure. I think they're doing a remake of this game, too. I'm pretty sure. Not a remake, but it's called, like, You Can Replay Ye. I'm not sure what, what it is or anything, but it looks pretty cool. I love that. Is it a gumball machine? Dr. Quack. Dr. Quack. Dude, the... <laughs> The sound effects in this are just like Banjo Kazooie, but my god. <clears throat> it's pretty great. The animation is awesome in this. World 4's golf course. There's a golf course in World 4? They always break the fourth wall in this too. It's awesome. I love when games do that. They're taking all of the knowledge. The special book. I don't know what the special book is. No telling. We totally need to get rid of all that. Look how pretty this is. All this land. And we have that stupid factory. It's an eyesore. Pants and why you should wear them. Uh -huh. I love, I love Lily. I love how, yeah, I love how she talks. Uh -huh. 
some old book on the new wood coaster. <laughs> And there goes our book. My profit book. There it goes. And they're golden, golden pages. <clears throat> even more now it's a flying book okay here we go so the camera it turns like inverted so i'm gonna i want to i mean i could turn i can make the camera where it's not inverted but i'll just get used to it that's how i've been playing this so once i've gotten kind of used to it no point in having to relearn how to turn everything all right so the first thing that we've got to do i think we could go up here I can't break anything open yet or anything like that. Yeah, we don't have any attacks. Can we go up in here? I can't remember if we can. Batship crazy, that's awesome. No, we can't. Okay. We gotta go see our buddy over here to even do anything in the game besides running around. That's pretty much all we can do until we go over here and talk to you. This peculiar fellow. I love his name, by the way. I'm gonna skip some of this. This is my buddy Laylee. Do we know you? Of course, me Trouser, the honest and dex dexterous salesman. Trouser. Trouser Snake. Yeah, I remember. You're the crook who sold us that dodgy flat screen. No, not me. You're surely mistaken, friend. Hey, Trouser, did you happen to see a magical flying book go through here? For five quills, I did. They're in demand. Now, this book business has kicked off. Perhaps you can find enough in those treasure chests lying around. Oh, yeah, this is where we got the tail whip. Already tried lockpicking those while, you're, while Yuko was asleep. No chance. Ah, oh, to unlock them, you'll need one of my trademark special moves. By using Square, our green friend here can perform the tail twirl yeah. attack. It's smashing. <laughs> we're gonna get more than five quills. We're gonna, we're gonna get a good amount. One, two hundred. Two hundred? I thought it was a hundred. So those quills act as the currency in the game. Um, I thought there was only a hundred, not two hundred in each world, but... Okay, I was going off Banjo Kazooie rules. And again, that was a very long time ago. A very, yeah. very long time ago. God, Banjo Kazooie is such an old game now. I'm pretty sure that was before Donkey Kong Con or Donkey Kong 64. Well, if that tells you anything, Donkey Kong 64 is ancient, so Banjo Kazooie must be insanely old. I don't know. Tui came out before. Donkey Kong uh, 64, but they're about they're they're pretty similar, pretty similar in gameplay and collectathon and all that stuff. I think Banjo Kazooie is easier though, in my opinion. I thought it was easier. It seems a little more laid back than Donkey Kong 64. The races were hard in that game. This seems to be enough. Jog by memory. Come back here. I'll be back there in just a minute. I'm gonna go... I kinda wanna go back up here to this pirate ship. See if I can get enough quills over here, because... What's probably gonna happen eventually in this game is I'm gonna have to find stuff off-screen. Just so I'm not boring you guys just running. Oh, yeah, don't these. Just so I'm not boring you guys running around in circles and trying to find things. If that makes sense. Which I'm sure it does. Because this game, it's it's massive. Dude. Like, the, the first world. Which, this I guess this is your hub area, but... The first world we'll go to, it's 
huge. And I still haven't finished it. Yeah. Like, that hour and a half that I played this game, I, that wasn't even all of the first level. That was... I didn't even expand the level. It was just something that you could do in this game. Um, expanding levels... Basically, it just... It makes the level even bigger than it is. There's more stuff. I'll, I'll have to show you. It's, it's hard to explain without, like, showing showing it off. If you don't know about it already. I love this guy. I think someone heard all the yellow newspaper this way and I accidentally inhaled it. I wish there was a hard-hitting cure that could pound me back into shape. That's a move. I'm pretty sure we get that move. Pretty sure we get that move uh, in the first world. We'll have to come back to him. Try to remember to come back to him. There's, like I said, there's so much stuff in this game. But expanding the level, it's... Pretty much you get pages. I think you get so many pages of a book, they can expand or make that specific level bigger. So you can do more stuff in that level. So I think... I think we're good on quills right now, yeah. Let's we'll just go ahead back to the trouser and move right along here to act got the actual good stuff. Long and Lispy spill the beans. Where's our book? Your book headed toward the business beyond this gate. Strange things going on in there since the takeover by Hivery Towers Corp. I'm headed there myself to sell some news. Allow me to raise the gate. Come on, Yuka. Let's get that book. Let's get that book back before Trouser realizes we didn't give him those quills. I don't think we can climb this yet. Nope. We get like three power-ups in the first world. So, be good. Oh no. Camera's kind of janky in this game. A little bit. Just a tad. Just a tad jank. I'm really glad that I got the hang for the controls and everything before I started recording this. I really should have done... I, I should do that for every game, really. I shouldn't go in blind and try to sit there and screw around with the controls. I should at least try to uh, get a hang for everything before I start. That way it's not as frustrating for... For me and for you guys, and yeah, it's just, I don't know. But, yeah, out of here. I love the enemies in the in the uh, first world. They are hilarious the little cavemen, and the sounds that they make when they run are, dude, it's so funny. They sound like they're trying to catch their breath. No trespassing. This is private property. Hello, we're searching for a missing book. It looks like it went this way. Your book belongs to us now, as will most of the world's supply before long. Mwahaha. <laughs> it's a weird business plan. Are you owning or opening a bookmobile? Actually, it's just one book in particular we're interested in. Now scram before I call security. Something wrong right about this place, lady. We should investigate. Well, let's do it. I love how they open the door anyways. They're like, scram before I call security. And they see us on the camera, but they're like, oh yeah, come on in. Sure. You can come right in, Ivory Towers. I believe this is the hub world. The actual yeah. hub world. Hey, friends over here. Because it leads to all the different levels. Yeah. Lovely to see you again, pals. I see you've got to spend yeah. time with your basic moves. You can give himself a short tutorial on the way in. Yeah. Smashing, time to put your skills to work. Yeah. And I've spotted a piece of your book. Dude, he's busy with those business phone calls, I'm telling you. Oh, I love the pages, they're so cute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why don't you go ahead and collect it and find out what's yeah, going on? Yeah. I go myself, but I've got yeah, an important yeah, yeah. call coming with my... Oh, coming up with the yeah. World One boss. He's after one of my super moves. 
Yeah, right. So you're gonna help the boss and us? He just, dude, Trouser, he's only in it for the money. He doesn't care about He's gonna, you know, rule the universe or anything, because that's, that's what uh, this guy's objective basically is. I just love the animation in this game. I love the, the sound and the animation, and the music, everything about this game. I just it is a, a love letter, dude. It's a love letter to my inner child that never grew up. I adore it. <laughs> Burn these things. We'll show you if they go up or down. Yeah, this is just a, an amazing. Amazing game, though. Goes the world two. Now, as far as collecting everything in the game, I highly, highly, highly doubt that I'm going to be collecting everything in this game, just because there's so much to collect. That, and I just, <laughs> I don't want to make this longer of a series than it has to be necessarily, if that makes sense. Because I have so many other games I want to let's play and do on the channel. And in my personal time, I've got a lot of games I want to play, which I've been doing quite a bit recently. <laughs> Hello there, who might you be? I'm a paging Elgin inside the all-powerful one book. The one book? How much is one of those worth? The one book is incredibly powerful, and it's been stolen by the evil capital B. If capital B unlocks the power within, his cricket company will have the power to rewrite the universe. Luckily, those pages have fled the one book and gone into hiding. Without pages, the one book is just an empty shell. Oh, that's dumb. If you use me to unlock one of the grand tones in this factory, we can transport to another world and search for more of my friends. Don't worry, we'll help you, Pagey. Come on, Laylee. Let's find one of those grand tones and search for more pages. Hey, pals, I believe I can assist you on your quest. Why don't you come and see me for the details? While well, you sure can't others is important business call. Let me jump from here and go and see if I can make it over here. Uh, nice. Oh, what is this? I, never, I didn't see this before. Got a gate. Okay. All these books down here. These books are being ruined! What if it's the one tree book? You can't use it now. Hey. This button. Yeah. Oh, I can't hey. hit it yet. Hello. Yeah, 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 yeah. Say, you two chaps need to explore these those grand tomes, and I'm looking to expand yeah. my business to new locations. Yeah. How about we make a deal? Yeah, yeah. For every grand tome you unlock, I'll help your quest yeah. with a new move, free of charge. <laughs> that sounds like a good deal, Trouser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Super, your first complimentary move is one of my yeah. trademark abilities. Yeah, yeah. If you hold down R2, you'll get the grip you need to yeah. roll up slippery ramps. Yeah, yeah. There's one note in the small print pals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One note? Is that what he said? Oh, he said, The longer you use this move, the more you'll drain yeah. your power bar, so roll wisely. Yeah. Instead of being butterflies, you can collect them yeah. and refill your power bar. Yay, we got a new power. So we can go to the first yeah. world. Why don't you try up, try your new trouser patented maneuver yeah. on that nearby slippery ramp. Before we use the ramp, let's go outside and use it on those other ramps to see if we can go to some more quills. That's what we need to do. Because I will totally forget that they're there. Here we go. Let's go back. Oh. Right back in here. Shipwreck Creek. It's just around the corner over here. Hey. Wow. Hey. Got that out here. Hey. We're around way back here. These ramps. I don't know if there's anything up these. Oh no, my god. Oh, does it just go around? It doesn't lead to anything. It's just like a little shortcut. I mean, that's useful, I guess, if you're going to go all the way back. But, okay. That's cool. 
It's useful. Oh, the wings up. There we go. That uh, that power bar will automatically recharge too. It's, it isn't like. Why don't you try your new trouser pattern da -da -da on that nearby slippery ramp? I'm trouser. I'm going to. I need you to get off my case, my boy. Uh, oh, there we go. Look, Lily, a pagey and a cagey. Amazing. Hell, capital beast corporate minions locked me in this metal prison. These pamphlets sure are pushy. Come on, then. Tell us what the key is. There is no key. Cages are unlocked by solving nearby puzzles, but you've not learned the correct move to help me. Okay, Paige, we'll come back for you later. Oh, it's probably this. Yeah, why something to do with that? Yeah. This. Nothing. Oh. Block here. Hey, you made it to the first Grand Tome. Grand Tomes are magical gateways to new worlds. Hybrid Tower seems to have captured many, but only us pages can unlock them for you. Stand on the switch if you have collected enough pages. We can unlock it for you. Well, I think I have. I think it's only one. I think it's only one page to unlock the first world. What makes sense for it to be more than one? It'll cost one pagey. Yep. I sure do. Tribal. What's that? Tribal. Tribal sack. Something. Oh my god! We get to go in a book. Wait, what's that behind there? Hold on. Can we go up here? Oh, what is this? Could this perhaps lead to another? Pa I hear a pagey. Oh, he's in there. Oh, God, he's gonna be burned! Why are we up here, though? I don't know. None of this stuff. Okay, whatever. Something back in here. Thing in here. A skull. More books. It's get smashed inside the book. Squashed in the book. Go into our first world. It's so weird seeing loading screens in games now. Like when I first saw this loading screen, I was like, God, this is weird, dude. I'm not used to seeing that from... I mean, I'm used to seeing that in old games. Tribal Stack Tropics. Oh, I love this freaking overworld song. So catchy. All right. So we have made it to the first world. However, I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. But when we come back, we will be pursuing Tribal Stack Tropics. Is that what this world was called? I, I already forgot. It was only like 20 seconds ago told us. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode or if it helps you at all, please leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time here on Let's Play Yuka Lake. See you guys next time.